they're both part of your community, but you don't want to not include the followers, and I think you want to include them. It still gets up. Got me with grenades. I'm still back here. cold frit like this that we call it frit uh, it needs to be melted in otherwise it could be shaked shaked off or knocked off occasionally uh, some of them are attached well enough that they're not going to fall off just because it I try not to think about it. It would make me smarter just to not think. Also, just to let you know, if you wear a shirt like this with a design on it, the design heats up. Uh, so it gets really hot. And so if you ever blow blast, just make sure you're not wearing a shirt like this that covers your nipples. It burns. Wow. So next time I won't be wearing this kind of shirt. a lot easier. Just saying. That, that strategy makes it a lot easier.
sometimes when I attack it, when you need too much too, that can cause that spider leg. So you slowly bring it in and slowly introduce the heat to it. So it might burn up and it pop burn, out. It might burn up and pop out. You don't want me to make ornaments? Why not? I know. I gotta make stuff. But if you make too much, then you might miss Christmas. If I make too much, I'll miss Christmas? Uh -huh. What? How will I miss Christmas if I make too much? Because I'll just be working too much? Oh, that's like the saddest statement I ever heard. <laughs> Go, let's go in there. Hello everyone, I think I got a delay in the video I'm watching so I gotta make sure I pay attention to that. Um, so what's up there is not actually what's going on right now. Hope everyone's doing okay. We're starting to uh, get back to figure out where I am on this link and I wanted to get a few more rows done before I leave for Gen Con. Let me fix my color correction on this because I always have to fix this. I always forget about this. So that should look better. I had an issue with my camera. My GoPro wasn't working. So um, I put my other camera pointed at my stack here. So you can see what I'm stacking, how far I am. Um, next stream I'll get my GoPro back in so I'll have that second camera to show you kind of what I'm doing. But we'll have the wide shot and we'll have the stacking shot. Uh, mainly I want that because I, I do a time lapse of things being stacked up there. So I want some kind of recording of it being stacked because uh, once I'm done finishing it I'll do a time lapse of it and post it on my to, on my uh, what's his buckets YouTube channel um, hopefully audio is okay the mic in here I might have to turn this one off uh, let me see if the audio is still okay yeah. all right you're still getting me over there okay so I'm going to continue on. Um, where I am, we just finished the belt, the row of this belt. So we have, I don't know if you can see this very well, it's probably not going to, it's a little overblown, but we are on this level right here with this belt. So this next level I'm doing, there is one pixel here and one pixel here that I'm going to have to do. Um, I could do two pixels up and I could try to, but I don't like doing that too much. So I'm trying to keep everything on, on the same row. So I'm going to have to do two of these brown pixels so I can stack everything in between here. So we might just kind of stack everything first and then finish off these pixels just to even up the edges. Um, so we're going to start kind of in this center part. Oh, we got a pixel here too, um, I believe. Where did I put that one up? No, that one should be up. So I'm going to start. Everything should try to level off. So we got that one bar in the middle here. This bar right here is sticking straight up. So we're going to try to do the two bar here and then finish off until we get to the single pixel areas. Um, did I mess something up? What's that? There should be one pixel up. No, right? I have a lot of single pixels to do. Okay. So they have a single pixel on each side of it. So this row is going to be pretty tough. So I got a lot of, I got four single pixels to make in this, which takes a lot of time. Um, okay, so we'll start with the two dark belt images here. 
get to glassing. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, JC. Appreciate it. How are you doing? Uh, there's a lot of thinking <laughs> that I have to do, but thanks for stopping in. Thanks for saying hi. Um, it takes a lot of time to stack, but uh, I really do like the images. If you haven't seen the images before, this one's kind of a large, large image. This is my Mega Man. Um, hopefully you can kind of see it there without getting blown up. Uh, but that's the Mega Man I made. These are going to be smaller of the link. Uh, and hopefully they turn out okay. So we're, we're cutting this one to six millimeters because it's two pixels. Each pixel is three millimeters. I have to cut a little bit wider. Find all my tools. I gotta make sure I clean that off again because it's been a while since I've been here and I gotta get the dust off of it. Cutting to the right. Just kind of flatten each side, try to make it fit a little bit together. I don't even know what I'm doing in this tube place. Audio seems low overall. Really? I think my bar seemed okay. Let me change that to that. Let me look at my audio real quick. I don't know if YouTube is just compressing it. I should be able to see in real time. My audio seems pretty far up there. I don't know if it's something through YouTube, but I'm peeking in the red, so audio should be okay. Um, maybe sometimes I'm talking away from the mic. It might be one of the problems too, just because I'm looking other places. This is, I gotta shave this down a little bit, just slightly, slightly past six millimeters, so. Get this down a little bit. Yeah, I usually been streaming on Twitch, but I want to stream my glass on YouTube. I think it's more accessible to people than Twitch. I'll keep streaming my game stuff on Twitch, but might be me, just no worries. Keep the glass in. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. It could be. I, I'll go back and check it to see and try to fix it for next time if it is something, but it's one of those things. Let's see if this is. Yeah, this is pretty close to six. I should try to match that one that's below it. So, there's one below it. So if we stack this on top, we try to make this even up. Looks pretty close on this edge. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. The belt top and bottom looks like it matches up. Um, so quickly before I continue stacking, I'm just going to kind of wipe the top of that off. It's not as important in the color area when I fuse this together. It's where the clear is. Since I haven't been in here in a while, I want to make sure I can take some of the dust off. Um, so when it fuses together, it doesn't have as much 
lines showing where the stack is. Even though I like having the image showing where the lines is on the color to make it look like it's pixelized, I want the clear to not be. Hello? <laughs> Here comes the hand from the room. As long as it's not the kids. Too tall to be the kids. Too tall to be the kids. How's so it going? It's going okay. Uh, I'm just trying to make sure I have the dust cleared off. Decided to stack glass instead. Cool. So, yeah. Smells like raccoons in here. Well, we can't. There was raccoons in here, so we can't help that. There still may be raccoons in here. I don't know. I haven't heard them lately. Yeah. I heard one time them climbing on the roof. I think they were trying to find their way in here, but I think I blocked it off. So I think they might have gave up. Yay! I hope. We'll see. Okay. So the only other thing I have to worry about is if this is level with the one I made before. If I measured correctly, should it? It looks pretty level. It is slightly higher, but I think we're okay where it is. Feels feels flat, mostly. So then we'll continue on here. So I need a, a green that is six now. Um, I don't know if those were broken before or something happened to them. So I need a green that's the same size. So I've made a... Uh, Mega Man was my first one. He turned out really well, and then I got too confident <laughs> and started making another one. So. You need a taller table. What's that? You need a taller table. Um, maybe. Not, like, yeah, I'll probably hunch over anyway because I'm trying to look at the edges, but. Had to convince myself to stream and then kind of wake myself back up and like reading to the kids puts me to sleep. <laughs> I get really tired and I start falling asleep while I'm reading the book to them. You made the mistake of having whiskey What's that? You made the mistake of having whiskey Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh. But sometimes the whiskey actually wakes me up. The beer is, the beer puts me to sleep. Yeah. Whiskey kind of hit and miss, depending. Margaritas will put me to sleep. For sure. That's too much sugar for me to sleep. Yeah. But. about right there. I'm like a toddler on a sugar high. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> and then I need a nine millimeter lighter brown. Mm. Basically a three pixel. Can you go on your phone and uh, turn on the YouTube channel and see how my sound is? See if I'm too quiet or not? I guess so. <laughs> Does my uh, meter say I'm okay? But I just so want to be sure. To YouTube? Yeah. Oh. Glass to YouTube, games to Twitch. Oh, okay. Trying it out. See how it goes.
Okay, this is a three pixel piece, so it should be nine millimeters. Got enough water getting out here. Oh, so it's dark brown is my one pixel at the end. Okay. Let's see. I need a coarser. Coarser uh, wheel, I think, kind of help cut down the single pixels ones. It takes a long time to grind these down, and the way I have to cut the single pixels, I can't snap them so short or so thin, so I have to grind half of the piece away. Basically, I have to cut it to twice the length, so like six millimeters and then uh, grind it halfway down to get the single three millimeter piece. Does that have to line up with anything? see I messed something up that I'm gonna have to fix. camera off. Almost, but let's put this here. Seems a little shorter than what I was going for. Um, because that piece down there is slightly longer, but I'm gonna have to redo that piece because I think that's a dark brown. Um, this is where I got messed up before. Now I gotta try to fix it. Or is this the right color? It just looked darker. No, that's the right color. It just looked darker for some reason. It's just in the shade it looked. looks I can't tell from here but it kind of looks this one looks just slightly a hair shorter than where that one ends but they're pretty close um, it might be okay I gotta put a one pixel on there I should line it up and it has to be should even out um, so I need to make a single pixel brown that goes there and, and lines up with this bottom piece try to make that work and see, this is where it's hard to get it perfect. I can't, I can't cut this to three millimeters because the glass is three middle millimeters wide. So I can try to do five, but I usually end up breaking, and usually end up having to do six. Um, actually, what I need is a flat snappers, um, which I don't have with me. I need to buy one. Um, so we're going to have to grind this down to three millimeters if it breaks off correctly.
not really supposed to reuse water, I think. So now I'm going to have to grind this down until it's square. So it, it, this is about five millimeters, maybe six millimeters. Um, grind this down so it's going to be a three, should be a three millimeter square. That's what I have to do, try to do. I splash all the water that drained on there. Okay. This is this is what I want to get a more coarse disc on here, coarser disc, so I can grind away quicker. It's got it's hard to hold on, so grind away my fingernails a little bit. And then once I have this stacked up, I'll take it to the glass furnace, heat it up. You know, well, I'll fuse it first, and then I'll take it to the furnace, heat it, and pull it. I kind of like stacking the sheet glass because I feel like it gets me a, a sharper corner on all the pixel edges. It just kind of depends how I pull it down, how much I mess it up. I'll try to get through a few layers of this tonight. get my music on I think it's gonna be a while to grind this one away let me turn on my Spotify Kind of quiet for me, but this has something in the background going. Hopefully, it's okay for you guys. See if one side's 
longer or not. And that means I'm not grinding it correctly. to a point where it's harder to hold on. Not sure what I'm at here. I know it's not three millimeters. At about four, so I got another millimeter to take off here. in the tube just to get the water to flow. Still not quite there.
I gotta get back to making and working on the torch because I do miss making marinis and stuff like that on the torch too. This is a different process a little bit, but I like the satisfaction of the kind of like the day of stuff. Putting things in paperweights, I haven't done that in a while. I really like to get back to making paperweights. Sometimes you hit it at an angle first and kind of flatten it out, it goes quicker, but... See if I can level this off and then we'll give it a try and see if it fits. Let's try to square it up. Both sides are pretty close. Uh, let's give this one a try. Might be just a hair long. It should line up with that one below it. You can tell it's just not quite there. Right, just a hair more and then we'll put a piece of clear in next to it but this is almost there it's not quite its squareness but we want to line it up so it matches that that one below it they should line up together um hard to see <laughs> but yeah so i have this piece here this one should line up these should all line up together I have to cut my fingernails after this.
ね。See if I can get my GoPro working again. I'm trying to figure out how my garage is going to get in the winter and how cold I'm going to be in here. I don't know if I can do this all through the winter. Got to move the grinding and the cutting station to my home so I can do it here. Just so I have more time. But un uninsulated garage. So gonna get cold. Got okay, Gen Con coming up this next week. So I won't be doing much streaming for glass and stuff. Um, I'll have some game streams of just like me walking around the Gen Con hall. Uh, but after that week, I'm going to try to do glass ornaments. Uh, try to start prepping for Christmas a little early. So I'll take all of the stream stuff to the glass shop and we'll do some glass blowing there, just making ornaments and a few other things, but mainly ornaments. Start stocking up on that. Edge pixels have to be almost pixel perfect. Sometimes I'll do a, pic, uh, a slab of it going up and down for you know instead of just one single pixel. I'm trying something a little newer this time instead of, instead of doing any up and down. I'm trying to do some flat. You could always run in place at the same time. It's true. You gotta get one of those like pedal bike grinders. I can pedal and grind at the same time. Get a workout. How's it going, Dink? Hope you're doing well. I don't have the alerts on because it's YouTube and I haven't figured out how to make the alerts work for YouTube yet without taking them off Twitch.
Looks like that's angling backwards now more, more and more. I'm losing all my water. It leaks the water out. We got this single pixel almost done. Doing well, don't need alerts. <laughs> okay. I know, you still feel bad when you make an alert for someone and then... I gotta figure it out if I do uh, the Patreon that way, um, how to make it work for YouTube. Separate from the Streamlabs alerts bot that I use for Twitch. But I'm still toying with the fact with YouTube. I, I may still go back to doing the streams on Twitch, I don't know yet, um, and just do highlight videos on YouTube. I do like going live on Twitch a lot. Um, it's just, uh, I wanted to try it. I say that a lot. I want to try it. And then go back to Twitch. And then comes back again, and I try it again. All right, that looks like it's pretty good. So now I gotta figure out that one last glass piece, what that is there. Put the one on there. It's understandable. Yeah. I like having an entertaining stream stream if I can. Technically, I think you could go to my Twitch chat and type something in the Twitch chat. And I think my alerts will go off on the stream, but I'm not sure. You can always try it if you wanted. Let's see, I think I need a 10. Cut it to a 10 and then grind it down until it fits. It looks to be about 10 millimeters. So we'll fill that up with clear. See if any of these are 10. It's about a 12. Actually, might have to buy some glass before I finish this up. <laughs> it worked. <laughs> there you go. There's your shout out. Decent delay though. Oh, that's all right. I think there's more delay on YouTube anyway. Just just a hair. It's supposed to be a little latency. I'm not sure if there is, but it's just a slight. It used to be. I think it got better though. I'm not sure. Especially if you're doing multi-streaming. If you're doing multi-streaming, there's a huge delay, but that's... That's different. Yeah, I don't think this is going to fit yet. Yeah. 
more. So I know I know you roleplay Dink. Um, if there's any games, I'm going to Gen Con. If there's any games you want me to look at, let me know. I'll try to take a look at them. Uh, I'm going to try to stream at Gen Con too, just walk in the halls, that kind of stuff. I'm going to be putting together some videos for the Stargate games that are coming out, the, the Stargate RPG that's coming out. Um, so I'm going to be kind of going around interviewing people and uh, putting together some videos for Dial the Gate. It's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be busy, but let's see. I'll be lurking, going to do some dailies on aliens. Okay. I don't know what Gen Con is, to be honest. It's just a big gaming convention. Used to used to take place in Wisconsin. Now it takes place in uh, Indianapolis. Uh, well, it was like one of the biggest game conventions for tabletop games and a lot of other stuff as well. I think it's interesting because like you said you're like I think I did everything I wanted to do on aliens <laughs> and then you're like I'm gonna do my dailies I keep doing my dailies and you keep playing it it's a fun game I really enjoy it uh, I just really enjoy playing with people it's my issue I, I could probably play a little bit by myself but I probably get bored of it without having people I know playing with me. It's a little bit more. It's getting close. I just got to get a hair of this off and then should should fit in there. too much but otherwise it doesn't fit correctly it's pretty good I'm starting to get the clear to be slightly taller than the color pieces so this brown here it sinks down just a little bit because it's slightly thinner than the rest of the stuff but these are it's pretty level Should be okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how that's gonna sink in. Luckily it's brown on top of it, so if the brown sinks down, it's brown into brown, and we'll see if it levels off. Um, usually, so far it seems like all the clear I've been getting is about just a hair, three and a half to four millimeters thick, while most of the other glass is about three millimeters thick. This lighter brown still isn't as thick as the clear is but it's thicker than the darker brown the green is just about as thick as this lighter brown 
So we'll see. I think once I start doing the other lighter browns here and the clear builds up, we'll have to see if it to see if it kind of levels out or if we're okay. I'm not sure. So now we can continue on this other half right here. Um, the problem is that we got to start building the cross. So we're going to need a single pixel on each side of here, which means this, this two piece on the edge here, or two pixel piece I have, this six miller piece on the end. And basically I have to split it with two pixels, the lighter brown and the dark brown right next to it. Um, I kind of almost feel like it'd be easier and I, that I should take this piece out, put a six millimeter piece in and put a three pixel piece on top of it and only do a single piece on top to match it up. Just because how difficult it's going to be to get that last piece done. I kind of have to decide what I want to do here for that. Then I just need a two piece brown. I would need a three piece lighter brown and then one pixel on the edge. That would eliminate two, eliminate one pixel, one single piece, single pixel piece that would have to do. So instead of two, I'd only have to do one. Ugh. Try. I gotta think about that. But the game is fun, and I want to be ready for new seasons. Yeah, I understand that. I, I want to build up my my stuff too, so I'm a little stronger for stuff. And plus, I want to go through the horde mode. You know that kind of stuff. Do that better. Just be stronger for that. Be able to buy all the weapons and the upgrades for it. I think what I'm gonna try to do is this a one might be a... let's see if this fits in there if it does fit flat then we might adjust what I'm doing here Too high, so I have to grind it down to fit. I hope you enjoyed the the highlight video I made. I wanted to make another one of just about alpha and beta how bad of uh, bots they are. <laughs> Hello? So I made a combustible dance channel. I didn't get mad. <laughs> yeah, you are. That's where my, my combustible dance stuff, any, any film stuff is going to be on my normal channel or vlogs that I do, but any game related or glass related stuff is combustible dance. That seems silly. That's the way it is.
That would be good. <laughs> my, my wife was upset because I have another channel now and I have too many channels on YouTube. Because I always get stuck with how do I market myself? Do I market everything under one channel? Do I market everything under its own channel? Technically, there's part of me that was like, well, I should market glass under one channel and the games under a different channel. Too many channels. I think that's why I like my Twitch channel is because I didn't create several of them. Just kind of put everything underneath it. I'll still use my other channel for stuff like filmmaking and you know personal stuff as well. Keep my glass stuff on my regular channel. Maybe. The point was my game related glass was supposed to go with my game related stuff. So if I'm making 8-bit art marini things, pixel art marinis, it's supposed to kind of be in theme with the games too. But I hate marketing myself. <laughs> I want to play games, I want to do the work, and then let someone else figure out where the content goes. Yeah, that's a little better. A little more level. I should be able to put this one in. team of people just doing all the behind the scenes stuff for me and I wouldn't have to deal with it I have more time to myself but it's not gonna happen okay so we gotta do I'm at the two pixels so I need a, something at six millimeter
That's the dream. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's interesting to see other channels are like, hey, we're hiring edit editors that just take my live stream and make some videos out of it. And it's like, oh, that's nice. You know, then I try, you know, put two or three nights into trying to make a, a highlight video. And after a while, I'm just like, well, how much time do I want to put into this? Like, how much time do I want to dedicate to one video? You know, if I'm trying to get content out there, I can't, like, spend a month trying to perfect one video if I'm trying to, you know, highlight a lot of my streams or something like that. There are some videos I'll spend a lot of time making. Six millimeters. Probably should have made the top of the cross first, just to make sure it's centered, and then fill in the gap in between there. Otherwise, if this isn't perfect. So now technically it should be a nine millimeter piece of light brown. you become a famous streamer dink go ahead and uh, I'll put in my resume to be your editor
Let's see if it's nine millimeters. Not quite. I'll try not to look at it centered up. I think too highly of you. We'll all be famous one day, right? Somehow or another. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Whatever you say, Dan. Let's see if this is centered or not. That one probably can come down a little bit, but I think it looks pretty centered or cross. I'm going to have to grind. It's rocking on this piece here, so I'm gonna have to grind that piece down a little bit. If I can get it out of there. It's gonna chip when you kind of rock them out of there too. I can grind this down so it's not rocking on there. It'll feel a little better. Kind of really hoping I would get this stacked and done before I left for Gen Con. It's just not going to happen. I don't know if this is ground down enough for that. Um, unfortunately, I have to put everything back together just to see and then find out. Maybe I can put it up against these two and check out there. Let's 
seems seems good. Get a full look at it once I get all these pieces back in. Here I see how this is starting to pop up over here because that clear is taller. So that sits a lot flatter. So put that in there. They have a really small pixel over there I have to fill. See how close that is. Maybe I can grind a little off this, make it easier for me. I think I could take just just a bit off this one just so that last pixel can be a little bit bigger it's hard to see but so if that last pixel is way too thin it's gonna be a lot of work to grind that down it's already a lot of work just to grind these other pieces to make it fit I got me just a hair more. Hair more room over there. A little bit. I don't want to grind away too much, otherwise it comes very obviously uneven. So we gotta fill in that one spot there with a small brown and then a clear on the end. And then we got 
that row. Bobby's in a really tight fit right now, which is good. As long as everything's staying level. So I really do, since the clear is actually just a hair higher than the brown that's on that level below it. So I really do have to make it perfect to fit into that little area there. I'm just noticing how much I ground away my fingernail there. Yeah, so we have one dark brown piece to make. Fortunately, I have a lot to grind off of it. See if this breaks off correctly, it might not. Okay. So this is gonna be the toughest speed of piece of the night. Kind of fit in that area. Very uh, coarser wheel. I'm gonna have to see how much they are. I'm gonna have to buy one. Maybe I'll buy one when I come back from Gen Con. I'll be able to get through this a little quicker once I have a, a wheel I can grind through for the single pixel. Because I already cut four of these. I know I have to do four greens that are single pixels. So I cut them. I was gonna try to grind them off stream. So I think that that's the thing that takes the longest is uh, grinding the single pixels. So I was going to make all my single pixels off stream sometime and then just get back to stacking everything else on stream. My fingers are getting sore already. A limited amount of single pixels I can make in a day. I should do Twitch Prime watch parties while I, while I grind glass. I have to mute myself or something, you know, for uh, when I'm grinding and turn it on when I talk, but I'm not disrupting people. I think that might be more interesting. camera for my stack glass and the movie over in the corner. Maybe we just have a creative movie night. Where it's like people who are creatively working on things, we all get together and we just kind of create.
creatively make stuff while watching a movie together. Because obviously when we're working with things that spin on high RPMs and we want to be distracted as much as possible. Too much vibration might break it in half. If it gets too too thin. Interesting how you can have a flat side on one side and the angles on the other just from pressure.
I know this one's not even close yet. Still have a third of it to go. Try to keep it flat as much as possible. Trying to get good enough to enter into a Contra speed run. I don't know if I can do it though. I'll probably get get uh, I don't know what you call it kicked out after the first round. I should see if there's a loser losers bracket. I think it'd be fun to do just do a race. Gotta get more practice in though. Starting to work on some new things, some new techniques, but none, none of them are consistent, so there'd be a lot of dying. problem is it's on a Sunday and I just don't know if I have enough time on a Sunday to do it. Square this up and see how close I am here. I am bit by mosquitoes. I don't think I'm in there yet. It doesn't look quite square. So give my fingers a rest while I pretend to see if it actually fits. Yeah. So I'll have to take off some more. Oops. 
can break it. How much of my fingernails do I have left? I don't watch that one. I don't grind that one anymore. One row is taking me a lot longer than I expected. I thought I would actually get a couple rows done tonight. Seems like I just so far have done one. Still not small enough. So this feels close on some of these ends. I think it's almost there. It's just that single pixel, you just gotta make sure it fits.
I know it's uh, difficult to have multiple channels and hard to get people to follow one channel, let alone several channels. But one of the reasons I did create the Combustible Dan channel was so as my glass and games would go there, but then it also kind of separates if I do any personal videos. I'd still put the personal videos on my main page or my, my page. And I can put the game related and glass related stuff on this page. Separates it a little bit. And I know that like, for the metrics, really when people are searching for something, they really want a channel that's mainly specifically for one thing. difficult to deal with. So close. Just turn it up like that. <laughs> I don't know if it fits like that. I want it to be the other way now so it matches. It's really close.
getting so thin I can't even pick it up with my fingers. Hope this fits. Fits on this end. Not quite on that end. Let me turn around and see if it works. grind it just a hair more oh, just because that one side doesn't fit Like it's in there, but it's not sliding in this one part. Like it's almost got to be perfect. It's so close.
little at a time. So we can get this to go in. It seems like it's not quite in there. It is in it's kind of popping things up a little bit. I'm gonna try to flip this around and try it that way. Fits in pretty well on this side. I think that fits that way. I think we got it. Finally. Fingers are so sore right now. Let's do that clear. I'll finish off the row. What do we need? Probably about 10, but something just a little longer. If I held that correctly, it's hard to hold a small piece. Small piece. Broke in the wrong angle. Got a larger piece here to use that. I don't think I got a good score on it. I think that's why. This one seems to be about 12. This one is closer. We'll grind this one down. It should fit.
Sometimes it doesn't even feel like I'm grinding anything away. I know it's grinding at an angle and stuff. I'm grinding it down, but it's just takes a while. Side fits. Just one other side is a little thicker. That means we're close. Had a huge mess here. We got that row. Jeez. Took way too long. Took way too long. So he has his belt. <sighs> Let's see. So he has his belt. A couple more rows, but I have his shield. I know it's hard to see. But we just finished this top row here with the belt and the top, that, the cross part. So next we'll have to do a single pixel up here. Um, single pixel on top of the cross and a single pixel on top of the hand. So we've got two single pixels to do there on him. Not looking forward to that. So yeah, I might have to buy a better disc here, one that's uh, a little more coarse. Let's figure out which one this is, because I think the the number on the back kind of wore away, so I have to see which one it is. But I'll probably get a more uh, coarser disc, and then I'll be able to grind down and make the single pixels pixels a little quicker. Um, and I'll do that while I, you know before I leave the Gen Con. So hopefully it'll be be here when I come back, and I can kind of get through this quicker when I get back, because uh, I do want to get to take this up to the furnace and pull this down into a cane after I fuse it. Uh, but after Gen Con, I'll be doing some, some ornaments. 
So I'm trying to make ornaments and, and start prepping for Christmas. But uh, I'll be doing this in the meantime too. Get, get this done. Once Link's done, I want to do Met the Metroid 1. Finish and do that one. And then on from there, I'm not sure what I'll do after that. I might work on a bigger piece after that. Uh, but I got a lot more on this one to go. Um, so I think that's the stream for me tonight. Let's see what time it is. I'm kind of tired right now. 11.30. It's a little early, but uh, my fingers are sore. So we're going to end it here. And I appreciate everyone that stopped in to say hi, hung out, all that fun stuff. We'll get back to this after Gen Con in a couple weeks. And hopefully we'll get, get this done soon and, and finish this up. Um, I'm going to jump back into this other room here real quick. Yeah, so we'll finish that up when we come back, but I uh, appreciate everyone that's come by. Uh, I think I have to change this. Um, sorry, I changed the setting for something. Monitor off, there we go. Um, yeah, thanks for hanging out. Uh, I don't know. I, I may go back to Twitch and stream this. I, I'm sort of feeling like I should just live stream on Twitch and make the highlight videos and put the highlight videos on YouTube. Um, the live streams, these long live streams of, of grinding are fine. Um, but I kind of like just having the highlight videos on YouTube, but we'll see. We'll see what we do. Once again, thanks again for hanging out. I'm going to end the stream here. If you like what you're seeing, subscribe below. All those, you know, social jives or whatever you say. <laughs> subscribe, like, follow, whatever. See you next time. Bye.